Okay, we got Fast Eddie. Not the upholstery Fast Eddie. This is the wiring Fast Eddie. Yeah, how'd I get stuck with this? <laughs> You're good at it. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Joe's car. Yeah. Pretty it's exciting. Good. Got everything separated for the headlights and everything that makes the motor function. And, uh, so this is way easier. You know why? Right there, we have a, I like your seat. <laughs> That works. Your, well, your seat riser on there. Okay, so we're good. <laughs> yeah. And you built this. Can you lean this down? We yeah. are now an auto meter. Yeah. And I, I built a jig to keep all the gauges in that way. And this is the exact, from the dash to the firewall, that's the exact width of it. So the other way you can keep everything neat. So while we're building that jig, probably what don't take... 20 minutes at the max to yeah, build Yeah, probably, jig. yeah, and it just helps a whole lot instead of crawling up under the dash and trying to do this. This way I can take everything out of this and put it right in the dash. So Here's it gives you your gauge. Signal indicators. So that'll come in behind the back yeah, here. That's all the headlights and motor functions. And here's your headlight switch. Oh, the regular real kind. Yeah, the real kind. So yeah. did, did that come with that kit? Yeah, it was GM, yeah. Just plug. The plug or the switch yeah, and everything? Plug and play. Yeah, it's already. Oh, wow. Yeah. And uh, Things are changing. The 12 circuit kit that we used to get all the time, they don't even make it no yeah. more. And I've got those the, around. This is a 23 circuit kit. Uh, 21 so. or something like that. 20. Yeah. And I got the dimmer switch on. And all this goes to the rear for your tail lights and, and your fuel sending and all that. It's all in that. So you, you get the kit and it comes in a big gob. So you yeah. pretty much separated, separated left to the right, out, yeah. knowing what you want there. Yeah. And I'm gonna uh, neaten this up some, warm through. And, and this has got the sniper, so it's got wires for mm -hmm. well, uh, for fuel pump and all that kind of stuff. Fuel pump and everything. It'll all hook up right here. It's already got for the fuel pump and for the sniper kit, there's a 12 volt uh, fused. And so we just, Kind of plug and play into that for the sniper. How easy can it get? Well, here you tell it. So, but anyway, <laughs> <laughs> well, see, if if you've done a few, you you'd be going okay. White and orange is usually for the brake yeah, switch. Yeah, I pretty much got the. Whole okay, way. so does that say brake switch on it? Yeah. So these actually say it too. Yeah, they say it on the wires themselves. So on the wire, it'll say they brake say kit. Can, and can. I know a pink is usually like for attack. See, just that? like this, if you can get a close up. Okay, so you got the ignition switch on that one. Yep, and that's. This is for the starter, and then that's the main hot goes into the fuse. And this will go to the starter to the right side. And, uh, yeah, after a while you do enough of these, you know all the colors. Yeah. And see, there's your signal indicators, which be little lights in the dash to, mm -hmm. for your indicators. Then you got yeah. GM column. GM column, just plug that in. So does it come it. with the several different styles? Uh, it does. Yeah, it does. So yeah. GM has a couple different plugins, but the wiring so pattern is always and, the same. Yeah, you take these out and put them in that plug, you know, and mm -hmm. put it in a different one. And they just, their pin connectors, they plug in and yeah. then it just snaps right into the column and you got all your Yeah, then the tax is going to be on the column, so I've already got, this goes to the, to the distributor for the tag. So you ran a separate wire for that? Yeah. So... So, it, so you cut off some extra coil wire, <laughs> it he, says, but you know it's for the tack. Yeah, and see, well, of course, it's running on out here to the engine loom here. Okay. And it goes to the tack. But it, if I can find it, there you go, coal tack. <laughs> coal tack, so yeah. it's, it's so a it, different color on this set there. than normally on the set yeah, that we're using. Yeah, it is, yeah. And I think the set we used to use was purple, though, wasn't it? That was for the, yeah, it was purple. It was, instead of white. Yeah, that went to the coal. But yeah, anyway, this it's a nice kit. So it's getting there. Yeah. We have Joe's gauges about ready to go into his car. Yeah, and then I got all this neat as you can get it anyway, mm -hmm. you know, running everywhere. For all the lights and the, all this, and then we'll have the, GPS signal sending that goes into the 
Yeah, we've been speedometer. Using, we've been using that a lot lately. I mean, but, for a long time, you had to stretch that cable around, make sure you had, your turn wasn't too then, tight. Then, and, yeah, then you had to, well, and if you didn't use this, then you had to have the right gear in the transmission. Then you had nine yards. Exactly. And more now, this is just, just plug and play and bounce. Well, and then they the had the one where you, <laughs> you would set it. With, uh, you would put the thing in the transmission and yeah. run the wires from the transmission. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, but now that little red button you had to set. Had the red button and do, and you could go a mile, or <laughs> you could just get it right. But yeah, but by the frequency, you set it by the frequency exactly. is how it did yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. And now the GPS one, I mean, it's a, I guess it's pricey, but for what yeah, you get. What you get and the less hassle, it's worth it. Or any more, I just, I'm driving my my new farm truck and it's newer than what i'm used to i just i put my phone in there and all of a sudden my phone's talking to the truck uh-huh yeah well, that's new for me yeah. <laughs> that's like too many electronical devices too many electronical so <laughs> my phone probably has a gps on it so I, we're already using those in some of the cars mm -hmm. yeah i know we're yeah. setting up the the radio and all that with the match with your phone and what have you so. right yeah I like that uh, design to go in the 34 dash. Yeah. So Joe, if you watch this video, how would how that go? Speak now or forever hold your pants. Something like that. <laughs> uh, I put these where they're straight in front of the driver. Uh -huh. You know, being the fuel and the amps is over there. I mean, that's about the only place you can put this. Yeah. In the center. Of well, that, it's going to fit to that. Yeah. And then we've got the tack is going to go on the wheel. It's a yeah. big tack. Yeah. It's, it's a... And, and this is, it's a pro street car. Yeah. Oh yeah, that'll look cool. Yeah, that'll look cool. Yeah. So that's about right. Right. And I guess that's how you drive down the track anyway, on your tack. You don't care about the speed, you want, yeah. you want to blow up your motor. Well, most of my hot rods, all I've got is a tack. I ain't even got a speed on the <laughs> Yeah. All right, so we got something for today. Yeah. I might do two videos today. So it's still early, fairly early. Right. Yeah. You're already here for three hours, but I just showed up. Yeah. <laughs> I was here later than you were last Thank, night, though. Oh, well, yeah. Here you tell it. All right. Well, that, now I got a favor to ask Eddie, so I'm going to turn the camera off on that one. So until until uh -oh. next time, there we what go. What board to board now? Well, I, I got some patio furniture that got tore up. Oh, yeah, well, I don't do patio furniture. <laughs> I don't do boats. No? No. <laughs> okay, we'll see. All right. So we're like two hours later, three hours later? Something like that, yeah. I haven't heard from Joe. Okay. He's got like about a few minutes. How long are we going to be able to until we start drilling? I'm fixing to start drilling minutes. here any minute. So how do we? We like it from the back window. It's looking yeah, pretty it's level. Good. I'm liking yeah. that. Good way to change the pattern over. Do it on a piece of paper first. Yep. Yeah. That way I had everything measured out and straight and level. And then That's going to look good in there. Autometer. I think it will. So we got uh, the shifters in. Had to raise that. The interior has already been built. So once you get it wired, well, yeah, I've, I've built most of it. You know, what we need we need the things for the doors. Yes, the, we do. For the power windows. Yeah, that stinks. Yeah, see, I done got this wired for the park neutral switch too. All right, good. We get a dome light in this one? Uh, no, I don't think so. And we one wiper. One wiper. That's all we wanted. Okay. Yeah. Looks like you got the overhead console made. Uh huh. So that just kind of slips in. Yeah, under that. Well, it goes this way and then screws okay, in here. Okay, so I don't know what I'm yeah. talking about. But <laughs> if you wouldn't have said anything, nobody would have known. <laughs> but uh, the console, I figured out also how to put his backup camera and all that in the console. It'd be, oh, that's it'd be right. right there. Yeah. We're in a new world. Yeah. Backup cameras. And Can you awesome believe that? Stuff. A backup camera yeah, in a hot rod. Well, if you ever drove one of these, you pretty much need it. <laughs> yeah. oh, we're modern now. Yeah. <laughs> I remember about 10 years, 15 years ago when the the TV thing came out. Uh -huh. We were selling them TV things. Oh yeah. Now every car you buy it new. Remember in Pimp Your Ride? It was a, TVs. Pimp Your Ride. It was something for them to put the TVs in the headrest. You remember back <laughs> in, in yeah. the 90s? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, that was a big deal. No, they had the radio thing. It came out of the radio. Yeah, it that's right. Up. It flipped up. Yeah. But that was a big deal then, and now it's cameras everywhere. I remember I put the first one in. Audio bond was in business. We yeah. That 56 truck. Yep. That was quite a contraption of a truck. Yes, it was. So there, there we go. So we're gonna edit this part to the front part. Okay. And if you hurry up, I gotta go load about, there's a trailer here to pick up four cars going to UTI. Oh, go, cool. cool. Yeah. So I may go load them up, come back here and see if we got holding gauges in okay. it. Okay, well that's, 
I'm fixing to set in on it. So we ain't got no hole saw big enough, so I'm just going to have to do it by hand. Okay. And, uh, well, good. Then we're going to see you autometer gauges in here. Yeah, that'd be I, cool. I will save uploading this video until well, we do that. Well, you video where I've already got it figured out where the, you know, the fuse box is going to go and where all the wires are going. So. Don't believe him. He's making it up as he goes. <laughs> <laughs> so it's all figured out. This is going to go together. All right, I'm liking it. Yeah. Making dust. The compressor come on. Huh? Making dust. The compressor come on. I came here. It's two. It's actually two thirty. How come you're still here? Because I wanted to blow that out. <laughs> you knew I was going to be back just in time. Yeah. So this is. A, it looks good. I like that. A lot. Work for me. It does look. I mean, that's yeah, where they we belong. Can decide where we want to put the ignition and the light switch. Yep. You know, probably both of them right here would be yep. okay. You know, the, the ignition switch lower, and then the light switch up here. You know what I was thinking? I told Joe to speak or forever hold your peace. Uh -huh. I never uploaded these videos. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I hope you like it. <laughs> uh, we hope you like it, Joe. We like it. That's about the only choice I had. Yeah, it was. Yeah. If you didn't hear any, he said it's about the only choice yeah, he had. These gauges are so big, there wasn't no way to put all four of them here. You know, and, and this, you know, it just wouldn't be right. Looks like a race car. Yeah, it does. But you it goes see like everything. a race car, too. But if we need to, I don't know if a steering column going to come here. We might need to put the maybe the oil pressure here and the water here. You know, put the fuel off over here or something, you know. Just swap them around. We can do that, though. Yeah. All right. Well, very good. There it is. Yeah. End of the story. Tomorrow's yeah. a new day. And, You're and going it, home, and I'm not. It came flying at us. I didn't miss it. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> good thing. That's a good, good thing. thing. <laughs> All right. So there's a, there's a video for the day. Our painter will be happy. Yeah, that will be happy.